Okay, in question 13, we're given a graph of an absolute value uh, equation or function, and we are asked to find certain things about it. Uh, first thing we're asked to find is, are the x-intercepts. Well, clearly it crosses the x-axis here, and this is the where x is 1, so one of the x-intercepts is 1 comma 0. Another x-intercept is at 3 comma 0. Okay, and the y-intercepts uh, crosses the y-axis at 1, 2, at negative 3, so this is 0 comma negative 3. Notice it's 0 for the y-intercept because this is where the y-intercept is where x is 0 and it's um, the y is 0 on the x-intercept because that's where y is 0. Okay, coordinates of the minimum. Okay, this graph doesn't have a minimum because it keeps going down forever. Um, so there is not a, an appropriate response for this one. Coordinates for the maximum. There is a maximum. It's the highest point of the graph is this vertex. So the coordinates for the vertex is 2 comma 3 and that's the the coordinates of where the maximum is located now we're asked to give the equation of the graph well it's an absolute value function and it's going to be y equals and we need to look at the slope to the right of the vertex and I'm going to do that in a different color here we're going to go down 1 2 3 and write 1. So that's down 3, write 1, so that's negative 3 over 1 or just negative 3. Open absolute value, x, and then we need the opposite of the x component of the vertex, so the opposite of positive 2 is minus 2. Close absolute value, plus 3. Okay, and that's how you answer number 13.